Weather Authority local weather forecast. Welcome back. Well, I'm still tracking winds. Thankfully, as we look at them right now, not as breezy, but this afternoon we were feeling a little breezy at times, but they are calming down a little bit, but that doesn't mean they are going to be completely gone just yet. So I am going to be tracking breezy conditions to continue. But first, let's go ahead and take a look at our air quality index sponsored by Imperial County Air Pollution Control District. It is looking mainly moderate for the Imperial County area, but let's take a wider view of our air quality for the entire desert southwest. We're starting to see a little bit of that moderate um, coming over here in Yuma, but for the most part, it's not the worst that we can be as we look more around the Salton City, seeing some hazardous over there. But for the most part for us here, we're looking not too bad. But this is something I'll be looking out for for the rest of tonight, because as we continue to have breezy conditions lingering around, could see some changes with our air quality. It could change by the hour. So this is what it's looking at now, and I'll definitely be bringing the updates later on. But let's break down our winds on when we're expected to be a little breezier because we are going to be feeling a little bit stronger with those winds, especially heading into tomorrow. But in the meantime for tonight, those stronger winds will yet again favor the Imperial County area, but gusts will be about 20 miles per hour. So it's a little bit calmer than what we felt yesterday. However, winds are going to start to increase heading into tomorrow morning. So in the Yuma County areas, we'll get a little bit uh, more stronger winds and these winds will be shifting and coming from the north, so it'll be increasing our winds, tracking peak gusts to be about 25 miles per hour or even 30 miles per hour at times in some areas. So we are going to be feeling a little bit stronger winds for our Thursday and thankfully for Friday, we'll see all those winds beginning to calm down, which is great as we get ready for the weekend. And the reason we're experiencing these stronger winds is because this um, area of low pressure up toward our north, it is filtering in um, some cooler air. So cooler air does mean we're going to have some cooler temperatures, which is great. We're feeling a little bit of that today. So we had 90s across the area and by tomorrow will be even cooler. So I'll get to that in a second. But for the rest of tonight, it's actually going to be pretty nice too. We're going to see low 80s and we're going to dip down into the mid and low 70s later on. And just looking a quick look at our overnight lows, tracking us across the area to be in the low 60s, even some upper 50s in some areas. So by tomorrow morning, it is going to be nice and cool and a little bit cooler than what we felt this week. So on our eight day forecast sponsored by Imperial Valley Hyundai, nice temperatures for the rest of the week, upper 80s by our Friday for Yuma. But I am tracking a warm up at the beginning of next week and going to be close to that triple digit mark where we might even hit that by Monday. So let's enjoy these cool temperatures while we still can. And we have Chaz in the studio with sports. 